Hey, greetings, everybody. Just a couple things real quick. Uh, first of all, Greg Kulin uh, from Canada, who gave me the uh, trackside guide from Canada, let me know that it is, in fact, published every year. <laughs> so uh, you can get the latest version uh, if you're up in uh, Canada, I think, uh, or here in the U.S. I'm sure you can find where to order it. Anyway, thanks for that for that update, Greg. Um, so. Uh, the winner of the UV5R8W is JJ Martin. Congratulations, JJ. I did just send you an email, so drop me a line with your shipping address and I'll get that headed your way. The next uh, giveaway will be for my GoPro version 8. I don't know if it's a Hero 8 or exactly how that, that uh, terminology goes. But anyway, I just used it on my hop uh, a week or two ago, and uh, so it works fine. But my batteries are dying in that thing, and I'm down to only two batteries for it, so I will include those. They may last a while yet. Uh, but when I bought new batteries, the new batteries don't fit it because I didn't realize that it wasn't a new enough GoPro to handle the latest batteries. So anyway, I broke down and just, rather than return the batteries, I just got a new new GoPro. So I'm thinking it'll be useful for somebody out there. So the link will be in the description to uh, enter that. By the time you see this video, I'm liable to be out riding. In fact, I'm headed west and we'll give you updates uh, perhaps along the way. Uh, and before I go, I'm including at the end of this a couple snippets of video that I shot. When Terry and I went to the view the clips in totality, I picked out Willard, Ohio, which of course is a CSX crew change point that I go through anytime I'm headed east. So I kind of wanted to get a feel for the place. So there's some uh, drone footage of that. And then uh, 50 years ago this summer, I caught out of Wichita, Kansas, headed north to Kansas City with a buddy, and I'm going to redo part of that hop. And uh, I wanted to scope out what the yard is like now. It used to be Rock Island, now it's Union Pacific. But anyway, they were doing some flat switching while I was there. And so I got some of that uh, on video. And if you don't think a rail yard at night's a dangerous place, think about what this would be like at night. Anyway, take care everybody. We'll see you again soon.
joint up here. About six on this end. 